Hello everybody, my name is Serge Belko and today I will start a video series about legacy software migration strategies. And we will start the first series from such subject as uh, migration uh, Delphi 1 to up-to-date Delphi version. Uh, yes, uh, and I, I'd like to clarify why did we prepare such video. We still today sometimes getting such requests from our potential clients and customers about migration Delphi 1 and sometimes it confuses. Uh, and the goal of this video just explain and prepare for the future material which will explain for the people what does it mean Delphi 1 and does it exist today or it, it, it does not exist. And uh, <clears throat> in the beginning I want to start from some history. And yes, like a, a little addition, this video more for the business people, for decision makers which just know something or heard something that they have such software by you don't uh, understand deeply what's uh, going on in, in real life. Let's start from the beginning. Uh, Delphi first was released in 1995. Yes, it's not a joke. It was February 14. And it was developed for developing an application for Windows 3.1 60-bit. And uh, I think not a lot of people remember such operation system, but it was the first Windows operation system with user interface. And why I explain it and added this history? It's 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 very important for understanding what does it mean Delphi One, because do we really still have such applications? Is it possible at all? Uh, and uh, I don't think so, because let's uh, check the statistics uh, which Windows uh, right now installed in the in, on the computers in the and all over the world. And you can see that even Windows Vista, which was I don't remember exactly which it was introduced, it's only in less than one percent. And what does it mean in our case? It means that target operation system it's installed on zero percent computers and machines and if you have such requests like migration Delphi 1 applications uh, maybe maybe you, you, you maybe you do not have uh, enough information or correct information because we think that uh, uh, in real life we don't have such applications nowadays and in this case, what we just suggest, just double check your source code, ask somebody, try to perform this analysis inside your company, or just let us perform this initial for business analysis. And, uh, but if, if, if you will have such application, such version of Delphi, uh, we think that it is, during migration you have to be ready to rewrite all your user interface and business logic on 95% because today's versions and what it was in 1995, you understand it's a totally different world. This is all that I wanted to tell about this type of migration. On this slide you can just check a couple of some information about about our company and here is you can find my contacts if you have any questions or requests about migration Delphi migrations from legacy Delphi versions to up-to-date to Delphi versions you can reach me in social media or just via email and I can help you as best as I can thank you we'll see you later